What's up everybody? No Name Tim here and today I'm going to be breaking down how I produce Purge off of Jay Zach's All Fired Up EP. Let's get to it. I get it down to the decimal, hire professional, get it precise. Back on the wall with no option to fail, and I promise you'll run for your life. See what I'm on, wanna fuck with the hype. If they going left, then I'm busting a right. Apologies sent to my mama for cussing, but fuck them if they not discussing the price. So this particular idea started with me going through some folders of sounds that I had, old folders that probably from six or seven years ago, I wanna say. And I came across this choir that sounded like this. So as soon as I heard that, um, the wheels started turning in my head. I kind of already heard uh, a tempo and how I wanted to chop it up. So um, I locked in the tempo at 145 and chopped the audio sample, pitched it up, I believe three semitones, yep. And came up with this little arrangement. And in addition to chopping it up, pitching it up, I did a little EQ work and threw the S1 imager on there from Waves uh, to kind of widen the sound a little bit. Once I had the choir uh, chopped up and, and where I wanted it, I moved right onto the drums. Um, pretty simple, straightforward drums. Uh, we got, there's a hi-hat in here, there's a kick, Nice boomy kick with a little bit of, bit of body to it. I did some EQ work, ran it through the Fatso Jr. In, uh, in, from Universal Audio. Um, we've got a snare, pretty standard trap snare. Got an open hat. Um, and then this secondary tap snare um, that comes in periodically, which is kind of a, a gross sounding snare. Um, it's not the most pleasing snare. Uh, to my ears, but in the context of everything with the other drums and um, and with the choir, uh, it worked really well together. So here's the drums when I play everything together. Once I had the drums laid down, um, I wanted to start adding more melodics to, uh, to the idea. Um, and that started with the 808, with the low end. So the 808 I have here, um, kind of distorted, um, got a lot of body to it. So when I pair that 808 with, uh, with the rest of the drums, we have this. So at that point, I really liked what I had going, but I wanted to add a little more texture, a little more melody, and really play off the um, the haunting dark vibe that the that the choir had set the tone for. So I added a pad, a piano, um, some Mtron strings, and a cost, custom profit bass that I that I made, and. When thrown in with the choir, we got a really cool little pre-hook uh, hook area.
throw all that together, uh, the drums, the 808, the pad, the piano, the Mtron strings, and the profit bass, uh, we have the full beat. Shout out to Jerry for uh, sending me his demo vocals so I could throw them into the session and and really dial in and, and make some arrangement changes and, and some mixing changes throughout the record to really make it what it needed to be and, and really do my job and produce the record top to bottom. Um, so yeah, take all that and then um, throw Jay Zach in there and, and we have Purge. I'm back in the mix, feel like I'm back in the sticks, rapping in back of the whip. I had the mods to pop and drop and bars, hoping they happen to hit. I ain't gotta switch sides, I'm on this side. So I hope you enjoyed this little production breakdown. Um, it was a record I had a lot of fun making. It was an EP I had a lot of fun making with Jay Zach. Um, so yeah, uh, check out All Fired Up out on all platforms now. And uh, like, share, subscribe. Um, and if you have any uh, more in-depth questions about uh, the production process on this particular record or any of my records, um, feel free to let me know in the comments and I'll try and get down in there and, and, and give you a little rundown of, of, of anything you'd like to hear. So um, thanks, I appreciate you all and uh, I'll see you next time. Popping a collar, staying on top of the dollar. Top of the morning, I hop in the shower. Get up and do it again and again and again and again. I'm not gonna stop till it's ours, nah. There's beauty in the struggle, huh? Ain't life a bitch. Let that be your inspo to get twice as rich. Get it while you can, cause the price will switch. Now let me see your hands and get hype as shit.